Good evening, guys. Jeff Fernandez here, Yoda Jeff on I Hate Mud. Here, excited to share something I've received in the mail. Uh, my 74 originally came equipped with a uh, washer, a windshield washer, reservoir, and pump, and uh, it's a sprayer nozzle on the hood. Well, my bottle was missing. Um, quick search online turns out Toyota Matt over at vintagepartstech.com carries an entire kit. Uh, to help you and enable you to run a factory setup. Uh, the kit itself is super easy to install and we're gonna go over that here shortly. So right out of the box, you're going to receive your washer bottle. And this is composed of UV rated molded plastic um, along with your Denso 12 volt pump. He does it, offer this pump in a 24 volt as well for those uh, uh, Australian models and Japanese models. Um, he includes the factory spec blue tint UV rated washer tubing. Um, he includes a harness repair kit. This is going to be your two prong connector with a blue wire uh, and a yellow tracer. Um, he includes a split T and this is going to allow the later models to uh, run both nozzles uh, simultaneously, top and bottom. And then a la carte he offers for those who are missing the um, incline wedge brackets. These are gonna be yellow zinc gold plated. Um, and they're really, really nice, really nice reproduction pieces here. This is gonna be your earlier style, and then this is gonna be your later style. Uh, let's get to the install. I've went ahead and cut my uh, spec blue tubing um, to length already. I got ahead of myself, but I'll show you guys how quickly um, this install goes and how easy it is uh, to get it going. So in my case, and some of you guys, this is a 74 model, California spec. I have an admissions a device here that's, that gets in the way of me wedging it through. I'm still running and uh, I'm still equipped with my factory bracket, the wedge bracket. So uh, for this video, we're not gonna use the ones provided by Vintage Tech. We're just gonna go ahead and use my original one and uh, we'll get to it. So she's in there, uh, just kind of slide it into place. and It's not going anywhere. I'm going to run my uh, tubing up against the firewall. There's some existing hold clips here. Run that in and then straight up to the nozzle. Um, this nozzle was also provided by Matt. My uh, nipple end was uh, broken off. Matt was kind enough to provide one um, and that's available a la carte. So now that we've got the bottle in there, nice and wedged, um, we are going to plug in. Remember, Matt's kit comes with a repair connector as well. Um, mine is still existing, so we're gonna go ahead and give this one a shot. Ran, ran it up through the firewall and up into the nipple. Okay, let's go ahead and add some windshield washer fluid. Okay, so now that we've installed our washer uh, reservoir bottle, we have went ahead and routed our blue spec tubing up against the firewall, along the firewall and up into the nipple of the nozzle sprayer on the hood. We're now gonna come into the vehicle and test it out. Turn the key onto the accessory position, find your wiper washer, rotate it, And there you have it, as easy as that. I want to thank Matt over at VintageTechParts.com for helping and enabling us to keep these vehicles running as they should be. Make sure to visit his website, VintageTechParts.com, for all of your classic Toyota parts needs. Uh, make sure to subscribe to his YouTube channel and view all of his tech videos on YouTube. So long, see you guys next time.